half, it was, it was a game of field position. We put ourselves in bad spots. Um, you know, we had a couple opportunities where, where, where things can go our way. We had the throwback to line, which brought his fingertips. If he caught that, it was, it was going to go a long way. We had the, the long pass to the table. And I, you know, the review we saw, you know, whatever, I, I could tell, obviously, that people at home can see it better. Um, so we had made some momentum plays that we could have swung things the other way. And then, you know, we're, we're trying to make a play. We got stopped with a fake punt. Um, we, we blow an assignment up on a block punt. It was a short field. I thought the defense played well. And, um, you know, for the game, we, we outgained them. And, and, um, can't say enough about how offense keeps competing and playing. And, and, I mean, Ryan Brand, a guy who started the year as the fifth string quarterback, is, is playing as one of the best defenses in, in the country. And, um, you know, I, I thought we moved ball for the most part. We, we obviously, there's some tries we, we could have and should have finished. Um, and, you know, we say it all the time, we turn over the ball, it's hard, hard to win those games. And, and we did do that at times. So, um, you know, just got to make more plays. Questions? Questions. DJ, it seems like you guys have excelled on special teams all year. I mean, did you look at that kind of today as, as kind of the pivotal kind of sequence, those two punts, and, and is that kind of when the game got away from you? Uh, yeah, probably those, those are big plays. I don't, yeah, we have played well. Um, you know, the, the, the fake punt was, I mean, I feel, feel good about it. We, we've repped it, executed it, um, but for whatever reason, we aligned around us. We, we were screwed up from the beginning. You know, it, it was screwed up how we moved it, and that's, that, that gave them a good field position. And then you know, the block punt, it was, they were set for return. They rushed two guys. We just, you know, it wasn't, wasn't um, one of those things really a, a breakdown of protection. But, yeah, it definitely did. It, it, it let the game get, get, get away from us there. Um, again, I thought the defense played well. We're stopping to run well. And, um, you know, they, they caught us in blown coverage when they, they, they shifted a couple times, and, and we didn't get the check, and they hit us on the seam ball. You know, other than that, you know, Meyer Consulting Engineers. In the past five years, our organization has completed over 1,300 projects in the U.S. and abroad, including many structures at the University of Maryland. For structural engineering and materials testing and inspection, call Meyer Consulting Engineers. Ryan, today, how do you, you know, you haven't had a chance to check out the tape, obviously, but first impressions on his first start, what did you like about how he, uh, yeah, There's plenty of stuff to clean up and do better, and, and like his fight, how he bounced back in the second half, I think he was a little tentative in the first half, uh, which we expected this is, you know, for first game starting uh, ever at this level, and, um, you know, but he bounced back and played well, he, he made some, some good throws, good decisions. Had some good runs, got to protect the ball. Even even all the way to you know the, the last, last series of the game, just you know can't turn it over against it because it's a good team. Is right here. Yeah. Coach, what do you think? DJ, in a game like this, where, where it is early on, but it's still you know it's still competitive. Is there is there uh, a feeling that you you have to take chances? And, you know, to get yourself in a position to beat a team like this, or do you have to play it differently? No, I, I think to me, you look at the second half, and, and you, you really you, you saw us finally just take a deep breath, relax, and play football. And, and I, I think we got played in the second half pretty clearly. So you know, whatever you can't take more victories out of a game. They, they want a game credit to them, but, but I will say we don't, we don't need anything special. All we need to do is, is, is execute and play the way we're capable. I mean, that'd be just good enough in most, most weekends. It's just to follow up, what you say, you took a breath. Is it a matter of, of getting in the kids head that they can't compete, or do you feel that they feel that way coming into the game? I know, those are hard things to measure. I, I think, you know, it, it's, it, we're, we're, we're a team still trying to find ourselves, you know, like, like I mean, let's call it like it is, and, and no disrespect to him, but I mean, like, Right, we had a, we started a fifth string quarterback today. Played one of the best defenses in the country, you know. So yeah, there, there was a little tentative. Like, can we really do this? Is this actually going to work? Is it going to happen? And and you know, we finally gained some of that, and then we just played. But you can't you can't do it that way. You can't let it affect your, your whole your whole game, and and, uh, and it did. So we're we're a team learning. We're we're in a process of, of learning and growing. Um, I love our team. I love where we're at. I, I, there's there's a lot of talent and a lot of guys that. that We'll continue to be part of this program moving forward, and I think we can win a lot of games. But I think we've proved it right there. And again, we go back to you know, just, just 
was going to play in the second half. And we, we came to the locker room, there was no yelling and screaming at halftime. It was really just, okay, like, are you guys ready to just settle down and play now? As opposed to shooting ourselves in the foot. We, we just, just play our game where we want to be. And they, they went out, credit to them, they went out and did that in the second half. Could, could, have, could have easily laid down and said we had no chance, and, and we certainly didn't. Coach, how did DJ Moore end up having a punt today? What was that situation? Um, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, DJ can do a lot of things. He can throw passes, catch them, run the ball, punt. He can do a lot of things. So just keep the ball as much as we can. DJ, can you talk about the uh, progression and uh, progress that Adam plays made to the point where he started the game today? Adam's doing really well. He, he's really coming on. Um, Practicing well, just uh, learning how to how to you know go throughout a week of prep, preparing, how to get yourself ready to play both on the field and off the field, learning your assignments and all that. He's becoming really accountable to what he's doing, um, so he's helping us in a couple of different areas. And, I mean, it's it, it's good. It's a natural progression. Like to see a young player take. He's very talented. It's just getting get all that talent kind of you know lined up in the right direction, and, and uh, he, he's doing that more and more. Thank you, coach. Okay. Well,